What is up guys and welcome back to another video. Today I want to talk about the mid-engine Corvette or the C8 that's rumored to be coming out very soon. And here's just kind of my general overall thoughts on it. So they are kind of pushing moving into the supercar realm. This car is going to be absolutely incredible. You guys have not seen some of the spy shots and things like that. Definitely go check them out. They're pretty much everywhere. Been going on for a couple months. Uh, but everything suggests that it is going to be a mid-engine C8 Corvette and it is going to push the boundaries of supercars. It's going to be competing with Porsches, McLarens, Lamborghinis, that kind of sort of thing. And it's going to be a very, very high performance car. Uh, it's been seen spotted with a lot of those vehicles, meaning that the performance is something of those calibers. With that being said, is that a good thing? Uh, in my opinion, I don't really think so, just because Yes, the Corvette is a performance sports car, uh, borderline exotic car, uh, American made obviously, but it also represents a certain class of people in price range. So when I think of a Corvette, I think of in that 50 to 70, sometimes 80, depending on how it's optioned out. Uh, car with these new C8 Corvette, it's probably going to be up to the 90s and even into the hundred thousands. Um, so it's really going to kind of push the boundaries of where the Corvette price points are right now, which I think is a bad thing. It's kind of pushing into a different territory. However, it's hard to hate on it because this car is going to be absolutely freaking awesome. And just like the Stingray did uh, in 2014, it's definitely going to increase the popularity of the Corvette. Um, you know, Corvette was not dying out, but it wasn't really super popular among younger audiences until the Stingray came out. Stingray came out, everybody absolutely loved it. It was completely different. I will give that some of the uh, more classic Corvette people didn't like it because of things like the tail lights and things like that. Uh, but it grew on a lot of people and now a lot of people enjoy that vehicle, especially the younger audiences. Something I'm hoping for, but I doubt will happen, is that it is a completely separate Corvette, the mid-engine Corvette that is. I'm hoping it's not the C8, I'm hoping it is maybe something off to the side, just so we can keep the Corvette price point uh, in that 50 to 80 range, and then also have the mid-engine Corvette for some of those guys who want that huge supercar performance. But it doesn't look like it's going that way. It looks like it's going to be a C8. It's going to be the C8 Corvette, which it is what it is. Like I said, uh, bumping up in price point isn't necessarily a good thing in my opinion. However, it will increase the popularity of the car. It will get lots of publicity. A lot of people are going to buy it. And it's going to be overall a good move for Corvette in my opinion. That's really all the thoughts I had on the mid-engine or C8 Corvette for you guys. Quick short little video. If you guys enjoy, definitely leave a like. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. We do Corvette mods on my C6 Corvette all the time. Also, hit the bell icon in the bottom right corner. That will notify you guys every time I upload a video. Um, YouTube's being a little funky lately, so you guys aren't really getting all of my videos and uh, definitely seeing that of you. So definitely hit that bell icon so that you guys can be notified and not miss a video. That being said, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. As always, go beyond expectations.